Hello and welcome to another Nicomedia quick tip. So I am back. Uh, sorry for the delay, but I was quite sick last time. And uh, but now I already feel better. And yeah, and now I try to, uh, yeah, to continue my tutorials and everything. But first, uh, a quick tip. Uh, in here you see we have I opened uh, R25 Cinema 40 R25 and many people wrote me uh, that they don't know how to use my scene rigs here in uh, R25 and yeah it is a little a little thing I, I'm still working on on uh, on updates uh, but it, it I have so much to do at the moment and with 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 this, with the uh, with my sickness in between and or everything. Uh, it was a little hard to do, but uh, there will come an update, but uh, you can still use the, uh, uh, the scene rig scene 25 and I want to show you how you do this with the asset browser. So uh, the first thing is we have to import in the uh, asset browser the old uh, lib4d files. As a, a, uh, in 25, uh, Maxon removed totally the content browser, which in my opinion was not a really good idea. And, but we have to live with it. And so we open our asset browser here now. You see, I have it now here in my scene rigs, Octane rig and rig ultimate. And I want to show you how to import this. So first of all, what I do is I make a new category here. So I create, uh, create category. And here you have a database and I have my Nicomedia database. And I want to create for this tutorial, I want to create a new database. So I say here, let's name it Cinema for D presets. No, not presets. As a browser. And, and uh, I don't know why they name it like this. This is horrible. What, what, what's going on here? But uh, I make a new folder here and name it just test. Uh, test. So, test. Okay. And okay. So now I have it here and I named the category here test as well. So that, okay. So now we have here a new category with test in it. The next thing what we have to do is we have to import the cinema for the, uh, the, the, the scene rigs, the old one. So for this, we go to the create here the import legacy library. So when I do this, I go to here. And I have my libraries here under presets. Wherever you have your libraries, your lib 4 d files, so please search there. And here I I start with the scene rig ultimate here. And I simply want to insert this scene rig ultimate. So I double click on it. And I want to make it in my new database named test here. And OK. You see it imports. And when it's done, you see successfully converted, in this case, 26 assets. Okay, and now I should have this. For, for now, I should have this in the converted things here. You see here, the Nicomedia scene rig is now in here. You already can use it here like this. So when you just simply drag the Nicomedia scene rig files inside the scene, it is here. And you will see it works as well. So when I go to here, and seen by cameras and where we see everything works here and uh, that this is the best thing you, that you if you want to test if it works make it here seen by camera that the background and tuck. so we can test it but the problem here is let's make a new file so I close this right the problem here is let's say we have a project already let's say you bring in a cube here and I have the cube and now I want to bring in my scene rig. So when I drag it in here, you see it opens a new file. And this is of course not what we want. This is uh, totally not what we want. We want to not to make a new file. We want to merge uh, the, the uh, scene rig into the project. So for this, we have to do a little bit. So close this. I again, open here the, the uh, scene rig. Now, what I do, what I have to do is go here to the layers and make everything visible. So when you see these two uh, symbols here, 
makes something visible. This is the whole scene rig here and the expresso rig. The next thing is I put the expresso rig inside the scene rig and now I can hide it again. I can hide everything. I just hide it because so I, I am safe. I cannot uh, delete something out or, some, uh, or something. You don't have to hide. If you if you are sure you, you don't delete or something, you can let it unhide, unhidden as well. But I do it like this. And now I have this file here and I go to my test folder and simply drag this file in here. So test is okay, Nicomedia Scene Rig Ultimate is okay, 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 okay. Now you see I have it here. I can close my file here and now when I uh, now when I make my cube here, let's say the cube here and then I now drag this inside here. See now it works. We have the cube here, we have everything here and, and when we go to the attributes, camera and everything still works here. And this is exactly what I want. But of course we don't want to go every time in our asset browser when we, we want it as a script here. And this is the only thing which is easier now with the asset browser. So this, this, this is a nice thing. So uh, let's close this. And of course, uh, if you want an, uh, a symbol here or something else, uh, uh, we can go here on the details, show details. And I go to here from, from preview file and go to my desktop. I have here somewhere my scene, screen press so here. And here I have my ultimate and you see now I have this here. And I have a symbol here, so a, a thumbnail. And uh, this thumbnail I, I simply uh, uh, took from uh, 20, from S24. And uh, there I made a, screen, a screenshot and used this as a thumbnail here. And now, the, the nice thing here is, uh, go to Shift F12. This is customize uh, the command manager, so the customized palettes. I would nearly make it every time with shift as well. You can go here to window customization and uh, customize palettes this as well. But I go here to edit palettes and now I can drag in whatever I want. So I simply drag this one in here. Let's make a group separator here. So, and when I want to, to delete, so, so that we can delete the scene rig, uh, delete. Let's see, then I should have delete rig here somewhere. Delete rig, yeah. Bring this as well to here. This script this, this still should work, so. And that's it. Now, when I can close my asset browser, make my cube, say, okay, now I'm happy. I want my scene rig, click on the scene rig. Everything is here. Let's see if it works. And so it is here and we see it works. Okay. And that and the same the same steps you do with the octane when you have when you have the octane rake you do the, exactly the same steps. And uh, yeah, and now when I don't want the scene rig inside here and I say no I want to make a bit of octane rig, go to my delete rig, whoops, and everything is gone here. And just the cube stays. So this is how you can use it here in uh, R25. It's a little, uh, maybe a little, uh, it's not difficult to uh, insert it, but uh, it's a little different. But uh, of course I will I will bring out, uh, I will send you by, uh, by email an asset, maybe, but I have to, to see how it works that I can uh, send an asset so that, that that I send you the file here, the test file, of course named uh, uh, like the scene rig. But I, at the moment I don't know where or what, uh, where it is. So, so I have it here in my asset browser. I have now a test folder here. How can I show you this best? Let's see. And uh, wait. Let's see if I find this somewhere. So you say, yeah, da da dum, da da dum, scenery. 
property. So I bring this in here. So I have now here my asset browser things. And you see we have here this scripted categories and everything. And down there I have my my things and the test one. I think it, and, and in the test I have okay, I have now don't you see I have this test here and here I, I have no idea what I, what what to send or what, what to I have to have a closer look about this whole things here but uh, I don't know why they make it so cryptically so 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 that's crazy but uh, I will work on it and so it will make it easier. But if you once did this and you have it here, so it shouldn't be any problem. And as I, and as I said, you make the same steps with the Octane rig, that works exactly the same then. When I go to here to my Nicomedia thing here, like this, so bring this. And you see, I have here the, the scene and, and the Octane rig as well, and it works. With the Octane rig, it, it works exactly the same here. So, and bye bye. This is exactly the same. Okay, this is how you bring it inside. And then, I, as I said, I promise I will bring an update as as as, as uh, soon as I can. Okay. So, and uh, for the next tutorial, this will come tomorrow. I I planned for tomorrow. I planned two tutorials. So. Uh, yeah, so stay tuned. I wish you all the best here from Austria Vienna. Stay healthy and yeah, I am back so far. <laughs> okay, so uh, yeah, have a nice Saturday and tomorrow, of course, have a nice Sunday and bye bye. Tschüss and bye bye.